अस्तुतर सेवतात्मा हिमालयो नाम नगाधिराज पूर्वापरौ तो निधिवकाख्य स्थित पृथिव्या इव मानदंड Hmm. I think we finished with the thirty-fourth. Yeah, tapasvinas sthano vanaukasastam akali ki imvikshe madhu pravrtim prayatna samstam bhita vikriyanam kathanchi diisha manasam babhu buhu. So when the vasanta kalam came in. at that time they tried really hard tapasvi all the yogis who were there in that uh, sthanu vanam sthanu vana is the place where uh, shiva is doing his tapas uh, those who have taken up residence in that sthanu vanam they somehow they curbed their mind kathanchit manasam ishaha babhuvuh they somehow tried to control their uh, uh, manovritti Uh, because it was an akaliki madhu pravritti it was a sudden uh, uh, advent of spring without its proper uh, there was no proper turn of seasons instead it just landed uh, uh, there without any uh, prior information next manmatha comes in so till now it is the spring uh, season that was described uh, uh, akala spring season now manmatha's entry and how everything moves on to a parakashta it moves on to a, 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 a climax here so tam desham aaropita pushpa chape rati dvitiye madane prapanne kashtagata sneha rasanu vidham dvandvani bhavam kriyaya vivabruhu madane tam desham prapanne sati when manmatha madana had reached that reason region when he came to that uh, 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 place tam desham prapanne sati when he had come to that place that is thanuvanam along with rati rati dvitiye he is only companion his uh, uh, the second person who came with him was rati rati was his companion then um so rati dvitiye madane tam desham prapanne sati he was he rati was present with him and the aropita pushpa chape he also had his uh, pushpa chapa that is his flower bow which was also aropitam aropitam ityukte jya sannadham asit it had it was strung and it was ready to uh, uh, aim at anybody so pushpa chapam actually you can take it as pushpa chapam also in the sense pushpa chapam also means sugar cane uh, bow or it can also mean a flower bow generally sugar cane is uh, manmatha's bow actually so aropita pushpa chape ityukte aropitam is uh, jya baddham so that which is strung and ready tadrishe pushpa chape um uh, yes yes ah so the one who has this pushpa chapam and along with rati madane tam desham prapanne sati when manmatha had come to that place now dwandvani kriyaya bhavam vivabruhu dwandvani pairs uh, all of these living beings which had formed pairs at that point of time they exhibited vivabruhu kriyaya with their actions they manifested by their actions whatever feelings they had in their mind bhavam vivabruhu uh, uh, vivrunoti vivrunoti is brunoti brunoti is actually covering vivrunoti is explaining or showing it out expressing so vivabruhu is in little akara here so vivabruhu they exhibited their bhavam with their actions they did not say that okay i am in love right now tathana it's more like their actions revealed what was there in their mind and that bhavam was anuvidham it was with uh, uh, sneha sneha rasa anuvidham kashtagatam kashtagatam it had reached a peak point so that which had reached it excess kashtana parakashtan solrom yeah so we we say how things have reached their parakashta uh, or its uh, supreme uh, pinnacle so kashtagatam sneha rasam tena anuvidham bhavam bhava or sentiment which was 
uh, with the, that rasam, that sneha rasam, that uh, love sentiment, which had reached its pinnacle. Okay. So tam bhavam dvandvani kriyaya vivabruhu. Pairs started exhibiting this feeling that they had in their mind of that sentiment of love, which had, uh, um, which was going to manifest itself in the actions. We'll go through the vyakhyanam. Itham vasanta agamana prabhavam uktva. After talking about vasanta agamanam, the advent of spring, madana agamana prabhavam eva aha. So he's talking about how manmatha is coming. Or the effect of Manmatha's arrival is shown in this shloka. Rati dviti ye madane tam desham prapanne sati. Rati dviti ye rati reva dviti ya yesya tasmin. Rati hi eva dviti ya. Rati is the only companion, is the second person there after Manmatha. So uh, when you say uh, chapad dviti yaha ramaha, then you say Rama was alone and he had his bow for his companion. So the same way here also Manmatha had Rati as the second person for him. She was the companion. Anena Madanasya Tasyam Preeti Abhimanitvat Sahaya Sampadutta. He was, uh, he had a great affection towards Rati is seen here. Rati Dviti, yeah. wherever he went, even if it was for, for war to win over other people and uh, target other people, he still needed Rati for him. Uh, and it shows his Preeti towards her, his affection towards her and Sahaya Sampat. Also that her uh, Sahayam, her help is a great wealth for him. It is a strength for him. Bhavam abhilasham samboga icha mityartaha. Bhavam is shringara bhavam. It's more like the, there are two types of shringara uh, rasam. One is samboga shringaram and the other is vipralamba shringaram. So shringara is love, which is in samboga is in union and shringara, so vipralamba shringaram is love and separation. So one is more of a, a, a happy sentiment. The other is more of a sad uh, shringara. There is a hope of... Uh, uh, coming together in Vipralamba Shringaram. So they show their love in separation there. So Samboga Icham, here Bhava is not mere wish. It's more like they want to be together. That Asha is seen. Kriyaya, Ichayaha Karyabhutena Vyaparena, Alingana Dibihi, Vivabruhu, Prakashaya Masuhu. They showed, they exhibited their Asha, their Bhavam, their Abhilasha through Kriya. Karya Bhutena Vyaparena. The uh, Icha is a bhavam that is present in the mind. And what comes out, actually the Cheshta is your Karyam. Any action uh, which reveals that sentiment that is there in the mind is called Kriya or Anubhava in technical terms. Madana Agamana Anantaram Sarvani Mithunani Api Suva Atmani Sanjatam Samboga Icham Tatkala Bhutaihi Vyaparehi Prakashayama Suhu Ityartaha. As soon as Manmatha came, Madana Agamana Anantaram, after Manmatha arrived at that place, Sarvani Mithunani Api, all of the pairs that were there, Suva Atmani Sanjatam Samboga Icham Tatkala Vyaparehi Prakashayama Suhu. So they expressed through their actions, which were appropriate at that point of time. That is, there are actions which are appropriate during spring, right? And they revealed that uh, Sambhoga Icha that was present in their mind, which came about. See, there is there is a Kramam for Manmatha Avastha, right? So, Netra Alokanam, and then there is a Manaf Prasadaha, and then you want, there is a longing to see another person. Ityadi Kramahatu Atrana Vidyate. Directly, there is only that Icha for union. So they, they skip all of those because it is in Akaliki Madhup Pravritti and Manmatha also had arrived there. If it was just spring, slowly coming in and then Manmatha comes in after some point, then it's fine. But uh, uh, behind uh, uh, Vasanta Ritu, Manmatha also came in. So it just quickly shot up to the peak. Their, their mind was very restless at that point of time. Yeah. So Madanasya Udyogam Aha. So how did Man Manmatha come there? Aropita Pushpachapaha. Aropitam Sajji Kritam. That which was ready. 
he had readied his pushpamayam chapam sharasanam his bow and he came in at that point bhavasya utkarsham what is the visheshanam for that bhavam that these uh, pairs were feeling which is kashtagata sneha rasa anuvidham kashtam utkarsham kashtam in uh, napunsakalinga is wood daru whereas, uh, whereas kashta in strilingam means utkarsham or disha dik it also means uh, uh, prachi kashta eastern direction so it means the different uh, uh, directions also so amarakosham says this kashta utkarshe sthitau dishi these are the different meanings in which kashta can occur so kashta means Even the parakashta kashta is a direction right a direction liye parakashta para, para, it's beyond as an climax climactic ah adu dik adu vand utkarsham not direction the para apara is they are not it okay ah the direction ah eduthukonda okay you take it as uchcha kattam ngrolya adu da parakashta so sthiti it can mean a sthiti so when you say para kashta or apara kashta then it can mean para sthiti hi apara sthiti hi in those cases also so adu da inga the second meaning is sthiti here uh, uh, avastha so dishi is dik so there are three different meanings for kashta here okay gatena praptena it is gatena ha okay kashta gata sneha kashta gatena sneha rasena anuviddham iti anvaya tatra bhavasya so kashta gatena utkarsham gatena praptena sneha rasena here it is dvitiya because dvitiya shruta tita iti it's a samasa where um, gramam gataha grama gataha gramam praptaha grama praptaha iti or krishnam shrutaha krishna shrutaha one who has one who is depended on one who has uh, surrendered to krishna so krishnam shrutaha krishna shrutaha this is a sutram for uh, making dvitiya tatpurusha so here also kashtam gataha kashta gataha kashtagatah sorry tatkala visheshanam cha idam it is the visheshanam for that particular time sneha eva rasa niyatatvat rasah sneha rasah rasa niyatatvat because it is con- uh, defined by that rasa hmm. Uh, I, this is a better meaning sneha atishaya is a better meaning so sneha rasaha is sneha atishaya or the excess of affection that they feel tena anuviddham is vijrambhitam the bhavam that is uh, uh, found along with this excessive affection that they show towards each other which had also reached a uh, peak so dwandvani madana agamana vashat param kashtam adhishtitam paraspara anuragam tat prakashakaihi karmabihi prakashayan chakruhu ityarthah dvandvani pairs in the forest madana agamana vashat because of the uh, reason that manmatha had come in had arrived param kashtam adhishtitam paraspara anuragam the anuraga or the affection that they had for each other had reached a uh, had b- become well founded in the a, a, in a very in a at a peak that is their their anuragam had grown to a, a, a very depths that they had to show it with their chesta so tat prakashakaihi ityukte anuraga prakashakaihi karma bihi te tu antarvihitam bhavam prakashayama so they showed their bhavam that was present in them hmm? they clear तम देश आरोपित पुष्पचापे रतिद्वितीय मदन मदने प्रपन्ने काष्टागत स्नेहरसाधम द्वंद्वारी भाव क्रियया विवृहु सो हाउ दे एक्सप्रेस्ड देर भाव इज एक्सप्लेन इन द नेक्स्ट फोर श्लोका मधुद्विप कुसुमकपात्रे पपौ प्रिया स्वाम अनुवर्तम शृंगेण च स्पर्श निमीताक्षी मृगी अखंडूयत कृष्ण सार मधु द्विप कुसुमकपात्रे प्रिया स्वाम प्रिया अनुवर्तम सन् 
madhu papo so dvirepaha the bee uh, drank madhu it drank nectar in a kusumai ka patre in a patram which is which was uh, just one patram there was only one patram which is the flower so it drinks nectar from the flower right so it drank honey from the same flower bowl because it was following its uh, uh, priya swam priyam anuvartamanah following or being very attentive towards his uh, uh, priya it drank madhu from one single patram so there is one flower repaha is a twice and the repa is a proboscis ah uh, illa uh, this is uh, actually a word formed from bhramara because the word bhramara has re- two repas it is called dvirepa some feel they say is it, it is uh, uh, bhramara is called dvirepa yeah bhramara is a uh, uh, b okay chariya the word bhramara has two repas in it yes. so it is called dvirepa it is a word etymology on that word actually oh okay so it's right, not huh? any double mustache or something like that no no, no it's that's not uh, actually the thing <laughs> usually some people have come to say that it is the double mustache but then it's not that <laughs> so so i have a different take on it uh, i've heard this bhramara explanation also but when you look at the other words for uh, animals and and bees like shatpadi and all that it's very descriptive of the actual insect or the animal itself if you look at the dvirepa the word repa by itself means a humming sound like like the humming sound the bee makes mm. there's a species of bee the the the, regular, the bees in india and in a certain region like kashmir and those those areas the bumblebee actually makes two humming two humming sounds at the same time one from its thorax and one from uh, the uh, regular uh, uh, vocal organs the thorax okay. also vibrates so if you look at scientific scientifically you have a double humming sound coming from this bee therefore i feel that it's dvire pa that's my own opinion okay, okay. and scientifically Maybe. according to national geographic uh, it makes a double humming sound oh that's uh, interesting i have not heard that explanation <laughs> at all <laughs> yeah, interesting nice why not but if you look at the kosham it clearly says dvau repau uh, yasya um uh, yasya bhramara namni iti so that is the shabda kosham that gives that this is interesting also so madhu dvirepaha dvirepaha the b kusumai ka patre priyam swam anuvartamanah following his priya it drank honey from the same flower bowl so the idu madri la yalaneer la rendu straw potu kudikira mari idu so kusumai uh, oh, that's precisely how i read dvirepa perhaps could be in you know two people sucking out of the i mean double dipping mari ah uh, double, double dipping da idu fulla <laughs> in this shloka and the next shloka is going to be like that but this is kusumai ka patre the patram here is kusumam the flower so flower is the eka patram it is the same sadharana it's the common patram for both priya and the dvirepa adanga so madhu papau it drank uh, nectar from the one single flower bowl shringena cha sparsha nimilita akshim mrigim akanduyata krishnasaraha krishnasaraha is a type of uh, deer which is probably the black antelope or something like that black buck adala so krishnasaraha the uh, deer it uh, akanduyata it scratched uh, with its horn mrigim shringena akanduyata it scratched with its uh, uh, on the horn uh, mrigim the female deer which was closing its eyes the sparsha nimilita akshim so it was touching actually and because of that touch because of that scratching it closed its eyes and anubhava uh, purvakam it was closing its eyes actually so sparsha nimilita akshim automatically because of the touch of the male deer the female deer had closed its eyes as soon as it uh, got that touch so shringena sparsha nimilita akshim mrigim akandu yat krishna sarah uh, actually dvirepaha um 
will go to the vyakhyanam adhakriyaya bhava prakashanam eva prapanchayati chaturbihi shlokaihi in the next four shlokas it is showing the bhavam of uh, uh, the uh, animals here so tatra adu bhramaradvandvanam mrigadvandvanam cha prakashanam dvirepaha swam priyam anuvartamanah kusumaika patre madhu papo dvirepaha is bhramarah swam priyam atmiyam vallabham anuvartamanah anusaran anusaran need not be just following but paying attention also can be uh, being attentive to whatever she does and it's constantly following her and doing the same thing that she is also doing that's the idea here anuvartamanah also means anukaranam karoti it's imitating whatever the uh, priya does so kusumaika patre kusumamaye ekasmin patre sadharane patre this is not uh, 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 like uh, common and vishesha patram tatha nasti sadharanam ityukte dvayoho samanyam iti that which is common to both of them so sadharana patre madhu papau pitavan atra nagarika vrittam bhramaraihi ashikshitam api మదన సాన్నిధ్య వశాత్ ఉద్బుద్ధం అభూత్ ఇత్యుక్తం దిస్ ఇస్ అన్ యాక్షన్ దట్ పీపుల్ డూ నాగరిక దట్ ఈస్ పీపుల్ హూ ఆర్ హూ లివ్ ఇన్ ద సిటీ డూ దిస్ బట్ అశిక్షితం అపి ఈవెన్ దో ద బీస్ డూ నాట్ ఆర్ నాట్ టాట్ ఇన్ దిస్ వే ఆఫ్ బిహేవింగ్ మదన సాన్నిధ్య వశాత్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ ద ప్రెసెన్స్ ఆఫ్ మన్మథ దేర్ ఉద్బుద్ధం అభూత్ ఇట్ ఆటోమేటిక్లీ ఇట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ యునో మేనిఫెస్టెడ్ ఇన్ దెన్ that's why they do follow the way that nagarikas perform nagarikaha hi ekasminneva patre sambhritam madhyam vallabham payayanti swayam cha anupibhanti so they first give it to their priya and then they uh, also drink payayeyuhu anupibeyuscha iti vachanat this is from kama sutram he takes the quotation from that and gives krishna sara shringena krishna saraha శృంగేణ మృగీ మకండూయత సో ఇట్ స్క్రాచెస్ ద ఫీమేల్ డియర్ విత్ ఇట్స్ ఆన్ కృష్ణసార మృగ విశేష శృంగేణ స్వయనైవ విషాణేన మృగీం వల్లభాం అఖండూయత కండూయితవాన్ కృష్ణసార స్వాం వల్లభాం కండూయనాదిభి అనువర్తితవాన్ యు టేక్ దట్ అనువర్తమాన ఆల్సో హియర్ స్వాం ప్రియాం అనువర్తమాన కృష్ణసార మృగీం అఖండూయత ఇది ఫాలోయింగ్ వాట్ ఎవర్ హిస్ యునో హీ గెట్స్ ద సిగ్నల్ దట్ ఈస్ వై ఇట్ ఆల్సో అప్రోచ్ ఇస్ ద ఫీమేల్ డియర్ అండ్ టచ్ ఇస్ ఇట్ రైట్ సో మృగీ మృగ్యా అపి భావ విశేష ప్రకారం ఆహ స్ప సంస్పర్శ నిమీలితాక్షి స్పర్శ నిమీలితాక్షి దా is there another reading of samsparsha nimi shringena samsparsha nimi litakshim nirkonmo ha ah, there is another uh, reading which probably the vyakhyata has taken here ah, samsparsha no or reading irukku samsparshena samichinena sparshena ah, vishesha sparshena iti not just a just a touch but it is more of something to reveal what is there in its mind right bhava the expressing of that bhavam tadrsha sparsha iti samsparsha i think that's a better reading nimilite akshini yaya tam atra akshini milanam cha sparsha sukhasya anubhavah it is the anubhava is a chesta that is it is an action that is seen which is revealing of the feeling that is present in the mind అనుభావస్ akandooyata so the moment it touched then it closed its eyes which would have given it that signal and so it continued apdi da irukano adu illa it's like a 5g in a <laughs> in the world you know signal sending ha <laughs> this is this is common in india if you watch indian movies you'll know this yeah yeah it's very andha kaalathu padam andha kaalathu 
मधुद्वीरे पक्कुसुमाई का पात्रे पपाऊ प्रियाम स्वाम अनुवर्तमाना हा श्रिंगे न चस पर्शन इन्हीं लिताक्षीम मृगी मकंडु यथा कृष्णा सारा हा ददाऊ सरफ पंकजर रेणु गंधी गजाय गंडोष जलम करेणु हो अर्धो भयुक्ते न विषे न जायम संभावयामा सर अतंगनामा गजाय करेणु हो करेणु हो इस फीमेल एलिफेंट हियर so Karenuhu, the female elephant, Gajaya, Gandusha Jalam, Saraf Pankaja Renu Gandhi Gandusha Jalam Dadav. Gandusha Jalam is Mukha Antargatam Jalam, the water held in its mouth. Tathu, it gave that water to the Gajaya Dadav. It gave it to the male elephant. Saraf Pankaja Renu Gandhi, the water was also Gandhi. It was fragrant with the Renu pollen dust of the lotuses in the lake. So it came out of the lake, it had filled its mouth with the water and then gave it to the uh, elephant. Ardhopayuktena, Rathanga Nama is the Chakravaka Pakshi. Uh, Rathanga is Chakram, Rathasya Angam to Chakram Vartate, Chakram Namani Vartate. So Rathanga Nama, which is a Chakravaka uh, bird. The Chakravaka bird also Jayam Sambhavayamasa, it honored its wife with the, by giving her a, a bisa lotus stalk, which was Ardha Upayuktam, which was also half eaten. So it ate one half and gave its wife the other half here. So uh, in the, even the animals and birds show that mutual love here because Manmatha had arrived. So Gacha Mitunanam. Chakravaka Mithunanam Chap Pravurtim Aha Karenuhu Gajaya Gandusha Jalam Dadau Karenuhu Ityukte Karini Female Elephant Karenuhu Ibhyam Stri Nebhe Karenuhu Ibhi Iti Stri Linge So Ibhyam Karenuhu Na Ibhe Ibhe Ityukte Na Na Purushaha Na Narau Naraha Iti uh, pulling. So even in, in Pullingam, it indicates a male elephant and in Strilingam, it indicates a female elephant. Karenu can be in both masculine and feminine. So, so here Sapta, we take it as female. Ah. Ibyam is in Saptami, yeah. Yes. So in a female the, elephant. So in, in the, the meaning. In the meaning of female elephant, the word is Karenu. Yes. And the meaning of, uh, but naan sulrapo, na is just prathamayaka vachanam. Ah, uh, prathamayaka vachanam. So, you will take it as uh, ibhyam tu karenuhu strilingaha. Uh -huh. Karenu iti padam strilingam. Uh -huh. Ibhe tu karenu iti padam na pullingam. Oh, tata. Pad padasya vikarha kopi nasti. Uh -huh. Karenu, 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 he wants samba idvera ardhopa yukte na bise na jayam sambhavayama sa yakarasya api tatra there is a repetition also so he wants that anuprasam here idella vande ayatna patitam this is not a forced anuprasa but it's an ayatna patitam naturally to his mind it occurs like that gajaya karine Gandusha Jalam, Mukha Antargata Jalam Dadao Dattavati. It gives that water to the male elephant. Gandusha Jalasya, Priyatama Vadana Samparka Vyatiriktam Api Gunantaram Aha. Vyatiriktam Vityukte Visheshitam. It is, in particular, it is very good because it has had the Samparkam, the contact or the touch of the Priya's mouth. But still, it is also more fragrant because of the flowers that are there in the lake. Not only does it have the touch of the female elephant, Priyatama Vadana Samparkatu Vyatiriktam Visheshitam, or it's uh, uh, excellent because of that. Not only that, Gunantaram Api Aha, 
another gunam also is there to that water saraf pankaja renu gandhi sarasi yani pankajani tesham renu paraga pollen grains tasya gandha asti asmin there is that fragrance of those pollen grains also the lotus fragrance is also there yatha kamini surabhila kusumadi samskritam mukhasavam kamine dadati just as how she gives a, a madhu uh, uh, intoxicant which is made more fragrant it's like a flower wine la and the madhu so uh, it's it's um, more made more fragrant because of flowers inside the wine adu mukha asavam asavam ittyukte wine or some intoxicant kamine dadati so tatra samskritam anna purified kusumadi samskritam purified by the flowers but surabhila nama fragrant surabhihi asya asti iti surabhilam oh so surabhi kusumam iti idla madri and the pankila surabhila idella vandu special rule irukku adukku panini rule onnu irukku குசுமம் <laughs> உள்ளசன்னயனி ஆயு சுமதுராணி சுராயாக பாத்திரதாம் பிரியதமா வதானி வதனாமி பிரியதமா வதனானி பாத்திரதாம் ஆயு திஸ் இஸ் அவர் மெயின் வாட் வி நீட் ஹியர் இஸ் திஸ் பிரியதமா வதனானி சுரபீணி சுமதுராணி தே ஆர் லுக்கிங் வெரி பியூட்டிஃபுல் அண்ட் சுரபீணி தே ஆர் ஆல்சோ ஃப்ரேக்ரென்ட் சுராயாக பாத்திரதாம் ஆயு ஈவன் தோ த பிரியதமா வதனானி ஆர் தே ஆர் ஃப்ரேக்ரெண்ட் பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் சுரா பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் தி இன்டாக்சிகெண்ட் அண்ட் சோ தே பிகேம் எ பாத்திரம் ஃபார் த யூனாம் ஃபார் த யூத் ஹியர் பாத்திரதாம் ஆயு பாத்திரமாக இருக்கும் தன்மையை அடைந்தன அப்படின்னு அர்த்தம் தே பிகேம் எ வெசல் for oh. the youth to drink sura from oh so, sura yah patrata oh sura yah patratam vadanani ayayu iti va yes vadanani ayayu yunam patratam ayayu so yuvakah yatah madhu pibanti tadrsha patra rupena priyatama vadanani parivartitani Oh, it means not worthiness. Not worthiness. In not worthiness. <laughs> from a, a from glass tumbler. Ah, <laughs> little ah, like ah. a chalet. Yeah. 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 Ah, chalet is that wine glass. Wine chalet, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. But yeah, I was talking about the pun. Like, that ta- is why you call uh, the lip job when you do, it's called a pout. Mm. Because you are converting it into a chalet. Mm-hmm. Okay. Patra ta ma ya yu ho ho ho. So, ya da tu ha. Ya da tu ha. Ya da ma ne. Ya ti ya ta ha. Ya yu ho. Ya da ta. Ya yu. நயனம் 
பிரியா அப்படியும் எடுத்துக்கலாம் உல்லசத்து நயன வாரி ரூஹானி இத்தியபி பட் இது வந்து என்னன்னா இந்த உத்தம காமினீனாம் சுவாசே பத்ம வாசக வர்த்தே இது பத்ம கந்தா வர்த்ததே சோ தட் இஸ் ஆல்சோ தேர் சோ உல்லசத் நயன ரூப வாரி ரூஹானி வதனானி இது தத்திர ரூபகம் பாத்திரு பாத்திரம் தத்திரம் between Uh, those people who were residing in that area ho oh, something like that maghe meghe cha vayogata rathanga nama ardhopayuktena bisena jayam sambhavayama sa rathanga nama ityukte chakravakah kokas chakravak chakraha chakravakah rathanga ahvaya namakah so kokah is also another name for chakravaka chakraha ityapi asti chakravakah ஆஸ்வாத்திய Uh, uh, if it is sweet then it will give it to the female so tena cha swayameva aadaya kinchit aaswadya tasting it a little bit and then tasya swadishtatam avagamya understanding its taste first or understanding that it is very sweet then priyatamaye dadau ityartha then it gave it to this uh, priya விசேன மிருணாளேன ஜாயாம் பிரியதமாம் சம்பாவயாமாச சம்மானிதவான் அத்திர தாம்பூலி தாம்பூலி தல தாம்பூலி தலம் அர்த்தண்டிதம் அகம் வாஞ்சாமி இத்தியாதிஷு பிரசித்தம் முகதாம்பூல அர்ப்பணம் பிரதீயதை ஐ டோன் நோ வேர் ஹிஸ் டேக்கன் திஸ் கோட் ஃப்ரம் பட் இட்ஸ் லைக் கிவிங் ஹாஃப் ஈட் அண்ட் பீட்டில் லீவ்ஸ் டு தி அதர் பர்சன் இதெல்லாம் பார்ட் ஆஃப் த லவ் பிளே ரைட் So, dadau saraf pankaja renu gandhi gajaya gandusha jalam karenu hu ardhopa yuktena visena jayam sambhavayama sa rathanga nama. Geetantareshu shramavari leshehi kinchit samujhvasita patra lekam pushpasava aghurnita netra shobham priyamukham kimpurushas chuchumba. Kimpurushaha priyamukham geetantareshu chuchumba. kimpurushaha kinnaraha those who have uh, either ashvamukhya athava ashvamukhaha athava ashva shariraha it can be both so kimpurushaha priyamukham chuchumba he kissed the face of his uh, beloved in the intervals of music so geetantareshu when one music stopped when one song stopped and before the beginning of another song he took that interval time to uh, kiss his uh, uh, priya beloved shrama vari leshehi atra kriya priya mukhasyaiva both of these are visheshanam here for the face of the uh, beloved shrama vari leshehi kinchit samuchhasita patra leka her face there are a lot of designs that she has made like uh, you know tattoos or idu uh, bindi uh, different kinds of idu pottu ella vechirukka so patra lekham is uh, designs so that design is kinchitu samuchhasitam it is a little um enna solrathu um i think it's konjam because of the drops of it is disfigured hmm? smudged 
smudged ah ama that was the word i was looking for samuchhasitam actually it, the paint is a little uh, it gets smudged because of uh, um the actually uchhasitana it's not only smudged and the it will grow madri la um and the if you put ah. a drop on paint ah um, it will uh, like it will expand a little bit it will ah. expand on, so on the yeah it be, uh, it it expands so this, a little bit they say that the, the mascara runs is running the mascara is running so that people get to enjoy it it's going uh-huh. that so yeah it's, it's like spreads spread. yeah it swells up a little bit right even in, if you put it on canvas let's say you have a, a watercolor on a canvas and you put a drop of water there it will just swell up a little bit the paint will swell up and uh, uh, right that's what is uchhasita patra lekam so shrama vari leshaihi because they've been singing and that fatigue brings up drops of water or sweat a sweat on them and that sweat makes the designs a little smudged up here pushpa asava aghurnita netra shobham their eyes are also aghurnitam it's rolling up uh, after drinking pushpa asavam after drinking flower wine so madhye madhye tatra madhupanam api bhavati and uh, they are singing at that time and yeah so sangeeta shravanam api madhupanam api idanim priyaya sah sarvam chalati chumbanam api tatra pravartate idi so everything so, atra, atra, so when you described kim purusha as either having the face of uh, ashva ashvamukham va ashva shariram it is really brought to mind that greek mythology that they have centaurs centaurs yeah. have the uh, horses uh, body human head and chest and, and they have arms as well and usually mm. centaurs are supposed to be musicians they have harps and they keep yeah. playing so Amma. samyam correct yeah evam himavat shikara vartinam mruga pakshinam kama vikara muktva kim purushadinam api ah after talking about uh, animals and birds now he talks about the kim purusha who reside in that himavat parvatam kim purusha uh, kinnarah गीतांतरेशु अतीत अनागतयो गानयो अंतरालेशु अतीत इज वन सांग इज डन अनागत अनदर सांग इज येट टू कम तयो अंतरालेशु इन द स्पेस बिटवीन दीज टू अतीते कस्मचि गाने गानांतरे चनागते अतीते कस्मचि गाने अतीते सती ganantare cha anagate sati when another is still yet to start another song so there is a small gap in between anena uddeepana vibhavaha uktaha so that ganam also increases the emotion it is like a rekindling factor for them uh, for the shringara rasam that is there in their minds so avasara gnyatvam cha tasya dyotyate avasaram is the opportunity he also understands that it is a perfect opportunity in between two songs ಶ್ರಮಾರಿಶ್ರಮಸಂಜಾತೇದಜಲಾನ ವಿದ್ಯೆ you go see the people who sing then you will know how they make a lot of effort and because of that effort they start sweating actually uh, so shrama varinam gana shrama sanjatanam vari lesha vari is here sweda jalam the sweat that comes because of singing because of the effort of singing leshaihi because of those little bit drops that come it is not completely abre uttala valuke ಅಬಡಿ ಇರಂದ ಪತ್ರ ವಿಶೇಷಕಂ ತು ತತ್ರ ನಷ್ಟ ಭವೇತ್ ಅತ್ರ ತು ಕೇವಲ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಸಮುಚ್ಛಾಸಿತ ಮೇವ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಅನ್ ಎಫರ್ಟ್ ಲೆಸ್ ಸಿಂಗಿಂಗ್ ಬಟ್ ಅಟ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಸಿಂಗಿಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ದೇರ್ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಅಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಿಯತಮ ದೆನ್ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಭಾವ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ವಿಚ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ರೀಸಸ್ ದಟ್ ಸ್ವೇದ ಇನ್ ದೆಮ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಸಮುಚ್ಛಾಸಿತ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ರೈನ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ವೆಟ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸೊ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಸಮುಚ್ಛಾಸಿತ ಪತ್ರ ಲೇಖ ಸೊ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಸಮುಚ್ಛಾಸಿತ ಸ್ವೇದ ಜಲ ಸಂಸರ್ಗಾತ್ ಈಶತ್ ಉಚ್ಛಾಸಿತ ಉಚ್ಛೂನತ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ತ ಪತ್ರ ಲೇಖ ಸೊ ಉಚ್ಛೂನತ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಡ್ಸ್ ಅ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಮೋರ್ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ವಾಸ್ ಡನ್ ಬಿಫೋರ್ 
Patrabhangaha is Patralekaha. Patrabhangaha also means the design that they wear on their faces. Dvitiyam Visheshanam Aha. And again, the Patraleka, Patra Bhangam Nale, I only think of these Victorian age uh, patches that they put in a Gadanto. Uh, a lot of them, the Victorian age, Lala, on the, they wear patches on their Kannatalala Putupa. You know, the way they describe here is it's on the cheek uh, or on the either, uh, chin and the Madrida. Um, there are people who wear dots and all here, le? and the Madrila. Yeah, in, in, in the Grama, Grami uh, Janeshu. Pushpa Asava Aghurnita Netra Shobham Pushpa Asavena Madhvi Suraya Madhu Madhu here and Madhvi is actually Pushpasya idam Pushpi iti. So that which has come from Pushpam Tadrisha Suraya Asavam is Sura intoxicant that is a flower wine, I guess. Aghurnita Yoho Idina Gauli Madhvi Cha Paishti Cha Vigneya Trividha Sura Madhvi should be Madhurasam, which is uh, flower. Paishti should be that which is in the Arachip under the uh, which is uh, ground and done, right? Like barley or grains. anything. Uh, grains and the beer on the Mari. Ah, and the grains. Madri. Grains the yeah, place. from grains you pishta patientam kritva yeah. kritam iti gauli yeah. na nantrila. Uh, gulikam, gulikam anna in my grapes, Maria. Yeah? Like uh, uh, ah, gulikam maybe. is a tablet, round uh, ball. Ah, uh, uh, then it could be grapes or something. Grapes and the Madri. tablets are gulikam. I think it's grapes and. Uh, or it could be a chemical thingy. Could be chemicals, yeah. Mm. Made pishta from. Madriana, Madriana. 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 Madhu, 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 honey. Madhu, like English, mead and Mead. Made from honey. Ah. Mead. Yeah. Mead. Yeah. Mead. Yeah. Mead. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that is from honey. Mm. Yeah, honey and water. Like alcohol. Cider. Huh? Honey, put yeast and you're done. That's wine. Mm. That is madhu, from madhu, like the the pada pada, like I think madhu. When he madhu. says madhvi, it is from madhu, honey. Madhu, that's what I mean. Pushpa asavan, there is also flower and uh, from uh, like plum juice and flower. Idhil allam flower is a vechin pandra dunte. Anna, adi rikka. So that East Asia la nariya unte. Rikka. Anna, anna, anna plums and grapes la adi lla pota fruit side hoyli. Adna la gul. So that. No, no, you mean uh, mead? Uh? Gaulia yeah. is a in man, spiritus in liquor. Mead, typically, you what? can Gaulia? add honey and any food. Ah. Ga Gaulia, Gaulia is? Spiritus liquor, that's what it is. That the... is what it says, okay. Mm. okay. Hmm. You have, uh, when you pair port uh, honey with any other fruit you can add in your house. Mm. Mm. So automatically, the yeast will eat uh, all the fruit sources and you will have that. That's how they control the alcohol percentage in wine. Mm. Okay. So Pushpa Asavena Aghurnita Yoho Kalishi Krita Yoho Netra Yoho the eyes get affected immediately because of the wine and uh, so uh, the rolling of the eyes uh, it gives a beauty to their face. So Netra Yoho Shobha Yasmin Mukhe Vartate. So Atra Madhviyaha Taddesha Sulabhatwat because it is very easy to get Madhu Honey, I guess, right? So it's very easy to get it in Himot Pradesham. Saurabhyadi guna vishishtatvatacha pushpa shabdasya upayoga. Uh, that honey which you get in that place probably is much more fragrant than what you get in the inland, right? Mountainous honey must be much more fragrant. That's why uh, it is equated to pushpa asavam and not madhu asavam. Gitantareshu Shramavari Leshaihi Kinchit Samutshwa Sita Patra Lekham Pushpasava Ghurnita Netra Shobham Priyamukham Kimpursha Chuchumba. The next one is about uh, uh, trees and then he moves on to Shiva. Just one more shloka and then description of how Shiva was in that uh, place. Okay. 